Episode 7. Now that the company has reached new heights, Colin and Bill decide to think on what the next best step would be in providing good management. They conclude that although things are running optimally, it is still up to management to continue those trends within the work environment. Therefore, it is extremely important for Bill and Colin to demonstrate motivation, leadership, and trust throughout the company. This will create a transparent environment. After promoting these things for some time, Bill and Colin recognized the importance of transparency when managing employees. It meant that employees and employers were open about what they expected from one another. This type of reflective energy in the workplace led to higher expectation within the company not only from management, but also among employees. Ring, ring, ring. Hi, this is Colin. Hi, Colin. Bill would like you to come to his office for a management update. Colin, sit down. Great work on all of your improvements. I wanted to brainstorm some ways that we can ensure that we keep the progress that we made. It would be a shame for our efficiency to drop back to original levels despite having devoted so much hard work. I agree. I've been meaning to talk to you about this. What did you have in mind? With new employees in newly created positions, yeah, I think that it is important that we promote motivation throughout the department. Everyone is a part of a collective team and therefore they should all be aware of the progress they've been creating. Agreed. I think that we should hold a team meeting that will cover the improvements that we've made and highlight some individual achievements. I think it would be help to motivate and continually improve people. Great idea. I think that we should also create some avenues for employees to demonstrate leadership and get excited about potential for upward momentum. What do you think the best way would be to promote leadership among employees? Do we want to offer a round of promotions? Promotions are always a possibility within this company, but I think that we should emphasize the importance of leadership within current positions. This is how individuals earn promotions. So I include the leadership possibilities in the motivational meeting. I would touch on the subject lightly, but I think that we could promote leadership on an individual basis. So I should pull people aside individually. I would start by pulling aside your employees, your standout employees first. Take your best aside and communicate that you have noticed their efforts. Explain that if they continue down the path that they are going on, that they might find themselves in a position for promotion, but don't guarantee anything at this stage. What about those who need to understand the importance of leadership the most? Hopefully any perform underperforming employees will be encouraged by word of mouth. They will hear about your meeting with the individuals and hopefully improve. What if I took inside underperformers and explained my concerns in a non-threatening environment? Great idea. Take aside your underperformers and talk about them with your concerns. Communicate the work ethic and constant improvements are attributes of leaders and lead to promotions. This will demonstrate that they will need to improve, but they are still always have the possibility of moving up within the company. I agree. Creating a competitive environment is important for all good managers. Just make sure that you do not threaten the employees unless there is no hope of improvement. I threaten the employees to unemployment. If we follow these simple improvements, maintain motivation and leadership within the workplace, we can only show improvement more than we already even have. I appreciate your time. If you have any other suggestions, let me know.